Melton Dante Mouse live in a cute little house. The house is up the path from the stream, and there they live with their cute little kids called Harold and Maybelline. Harold and Maybelline were continuously chatty. They would drive Melda and Dante quite batty. Chatty, you say? How do they behave? Well, they communicate through extra special supersonic waves. We unfortunately can't hear them because they have high frequencies that cause mayhem. One morning after breakfast, Harold and Maybelline decided to sneak down to the ground floor and out through the door. They wanted to be outside to run around in the sun. The weather was lovely and not too hot. The brother and sister left with a trot down to the stream and across the rocks. The mountain water felt like an ice box. Oh, let's swim, cried Harold. It's cold, replied Maybelline. I may lose a limb. Mice can swim quite well, you know. They are rather good and have been known to hold their breath for up to three minutes if they should. The two siblings carried on up the rocks until they arrived at a big wooden box. What could this be, they wondered. Let's investigate, Harold thundered. They peered inside and what did they see? Some herbs, lettuce and a triangle of brie. Ooh, what is this, they cried, a treasure no doubt. We wonder what it's doing here, out and about. Do you think I can have a bite, asked Maybelline. I'm feeling rather snackish and wouldn't mind a green bean. At just that moment, from behind a rock, Mervyn Mongoose popped up and gave them a shock. Morning, Mervyn, you gave us a fright. Morning, you two, you're looking quite bright. Harold and Maybelline explained they were out on an adventure. Mervyn explained, perhaps we can turn this into a joint venture. I've been gathering fresh organic herbs and vegetables for the cafe. Would you care to join me on my journey back down? And I'll whip up just for you a cheese souffle. Yay, the mouse siblings cried, we'll gladly help. This is very auspicious and your cheese souffle sounds so delicious. Mervyn, Harold and Maybelline made their way back to the Mongoose Cafe after foraging for fresh herbs and vegetables to make something gourmet. Foraging, you say? What is that? When you forage, you identify and collect herbs and plants that grow wild in nature and are healthy, that's a fact. Mervyn packed his treasures away in the kitchen and whipped up the best souffle Harold and Maybelline had ever tasted and made them smile the whole day.